Hello folks and welcome back to Ravenport 22. Here we are, the sun is setting on November. And yeah, first of all we're going to be doing is fertilising our fields. Because yeah, we've just harvested them. They need mulching. However, I'm thinking of if we fertilise, then mulch, and then when we drill, we'll get a drill that has a fertilizer application on it because I'm going to lease a drill out. Also, as you may have noticed, money's gone down. That's because I've gone and purchased fields 14 and 17. However, 17 needs stones to be picked. That's been plowed. So, yeah, I'm going to rock pick all that and see how much we can get. See if it's worth making things like lime in that with stone and lime production mods or a variety of that that I am not sure however I'm going to get it all done that off camera now so yep I thought yeah sorry the episode by telling what I'm going to be doing and then yep I'll see you folks in November 2 by the time we're done this and yep We'll get the new drill we're going to be borrowing out and go from there. And alright, we are done. We had, what, like 26,000 litres of stones? That's been converted into lime, and yes, overall, I'm not sure if this was worth it. So, so that, yeah, get half our money back. So yeah, if we have a look at our field, see actually what needs work now. I haven't checked on liming yet. So yeah, no lime is needed. A little bit soon is left over, but overall I'm not too worried. Checking the ploughing. Nope. And fertilizer you should be relatively fine. Yep, yeah, should you put that second application on once we are all good there? Uh, yeah, in terms with what we're doing, we also done mulching. <laughs> yeah, it's been a while since I've actually done recording that segment. But yeah, so these don't need mulching because that's been ploughed and cultivated. So we've got 57,000 litres of lime. So let's see where we need to take these two. If I'm to guess, probably the sell everything container and how much I'm going to get from it. 403 bucks, so overall not a lot, and especially when considering the cost of the leasing equipment. Yeah, we're on thin margins at the moment, but let's see how much money you can get back from this. So there we go, we should get back up to the 50 grand mark, and yeah, the reason why money's gone down a bit is because we're running out of sugar uh, when it comes to the greenhouses. Actually, not the greenhouse, sorry, the juice factory. And yeah, I first of all saw like the sugar nut here, like, yeah, 1500 years required a month. We should back up to 40 grand, not 50 grand. So yeah, I gone and bought a load of sugar, 10,000 liters, and I thought I was for all of these, but no, sugar is only required for the lemonade, so we've got what? two four eight months worth of sugar here so yeah we're not too bad but unfortunately because these come in such a small pallets or small little packets because they're part of the artillery production mod yeah the fps does crap a load there we go get some delicious frames back and yes i know these all ain't except here that's why i bought the pallet up here but yeah, so we're back up to 40 grand. Ah, oh, don't tell me we've hit. Oh, lovely. Oh, fine. And to be honest, yeah, we have like, what, 10,000 litres? And yeah, unfortunately, uh, fine. Not fine. <laughs> I'm just going to leave that there. I'm going to not worry about that. So, you for now can go there. That will get consumed over time. So yeah, actually to get on to the main purpose of the episode, we're just drilling, so 40 grand. So yeah, we can plant wheat and yeah, we can plant grass if we want to. But actually do we plant grass? Because for how much we're gonna get from silage, I'm rethinking 
throwing at least one of these fields into grass, so... Because, yes, do we actually need any crops now for productions? At the moment, no, not really, but... I do want to get some productions in. Um, as of today, we're recording this part here. On Friday, there is a brand new mod. Or a new update. The Open Air Garden by Miss Omatana. And that is huge. Oh, yeah, I'm rethinking. Get, really get a couple of these down. But again, the problem for us at the moment is having the space. So, yeah, trying to find a flat-ish part. <laughs> Ugh. Funny enough, the part's flat is actually where we started off with. Actually, can we put it up here, I wonder, because... Yes, if we get like, some of those crops coming in. Oof. Yeah. No, is the answer. Just because it's such a huge gap in that. And yeah, the train is undulating quite a bit. So we need to figure out a placeable area. So, oh, we've got this bit here. That is 77 grand. Or, there is this area up here. So. Yeah, because I'm thinking, you know, purchasing this area and that. Relatively flattish, and. Let's say, hypothetically, we purchase this. Because, yeah, we still need to drill on that. Yeah, and I'm going to borrow a drill because. Yeah, we've got a lot of work to do. But, yeah, greenhouses. Get you. Alright, yeah, not enough money, but. In theory, should be fine. Yes, yeah, so I think if we get a couple of these down, because in my mod review, I can't remember the exact figures, but I think it's like with grapes and tomatoes and that, we can get 32,000 litres a month just from water and a bit of manure and fertilizer, which we can purchase. Nor we can get cheap enough, so. Because, yeah, if I get 50,000 litres of grapes a month. Actually, no, if we have both going on the way at the same time, that'd be 80,000 years a month. Ah, uh, yeah. How much are grapes worth? I oh, do you wonder, actually, due to where you are. Wow. Okay, so... 2,200, let's say. 80 grand a month. Or 80,000 years a month. That is what, 176,000 we can get a month? Potentially. I'm sorry about that little hiccups there, so. Ooh. I may keep that purchase for now, but. Anyways, we need to get our cedar and that, or planter, so. Oh, which one was I going to use? Thinking. I for one of these, the momentum stuff, that's cost ten grand though. That is very expensive, actually. How Yeah, three fifteen, so we can't even go for the the medium one. We have to go with the little one. Anything to use market? Oh, sprayer. We do need a sprayer in that, but now we've got the ability to lease. Honestly, I'm thinking of just sticking with borrowing them when we need it. But yeah, you know what I think? Let's go with the Kinsey stuff, so... We can go with the 18.2 meter, or 12 meter, so... How much is that? 8 grand. I'm going to keep it all standard. I'm not going to go unrealistic in that. That's one thing I am avoiding with this series, because, yeah. Obviously, with Inch Survival, if that is kept going... Uh, yeah, at the moment, not too sure at the moment, but yeah, obviously, as I record this, I am planning on if I could get this done early enough this evening. So, at the moment, it oh sh shit, it's 11 o'clock, so this is gonna come out some point tomorrow morning. And yes, if I could get this recorded, I get the new Let's Play recorded overnight. I have two videos up tomorrow. Yeah, because I'm going to start a brand new Let's Play series, and whenever my next video is going to be after that, 
I will make sure it is Vintage Survival. Because, yeah, I've, I've neglected that a little bit. So, yeah, let me get this all set up a sec. So, right, there we go. I've got that at least. And, yeah, I thought, yeah, we're just using a class. Go with all class. And, dang it, I've got two bags off seized by accident. Or, was it accident or on purpose? I don't know. Because, yes, yeah, this does require liquid fertilizer. And, do I have the mod? No. Ooh. I'm actually saying that I've got this, so the liquid fertilizer barrel. That is 180 yes, actually you know what? I'm tempted to go with that, so get this one filled as well. But saying that we don't need it for we don't need it for this field here, so that field could be done last. And yeah, that's even if what gonna be finished plant there, really. Can we do wheat and grass? I'm thinking do wheat on the big field over here. And then grass on this field over here afterwards. So yeah, let me get the liquid fertilizer filled up. And actually what I remember, let's go and fill this up as well. So yeah, we'll do the wheat with this and the grass with that. And there we go, we're at the field now, so We'll go and get this unfolded. Yep, worker should be just about done, so... Actually, I did feel quite nice it did, so... What I'm going to do now is just go up and down here. I'll say two times before setting the worker off. It's more just this section here where the green mill is, because obviously... As you see, it stops early in that to turn around in that, so... I can't have that, so I just want the worker to go up and down, not to mess around with anything afterwards, so let me just quickly get these sections here done. So alright, did more than just a couple of times, so yeah, now that is all set up, so now I'll get the worker set off. Yeah, just try to work for that section, just to make sure everything was in all a perfectly nice straight line. And actually, one thing I'm going to do is sell this land, because... I need the money, not only for the workers, but also to get whatever we have left over. Some propane in that for tomorrow. So I want to be a little bit cheeky here, let's get the propane now. Before we get any fees for... It's not so much the lease and stuff, it's more of the loan interest in that. Because yes, I know that's going to be pretty high. And we're using a quite a bit of the liquid fertilizer, so... Fair enough, I should have said screw it now, because yeah, once we roll this, I'll just get our very effective fertilizer spread and use that instead. See, so, you know, that even cost us, what, maybe a grand or so? So overall, wasn't that bad, but yeah, should have thought ahead about that. But anyway, so, I'm going to spend some time with this, I'm going to get this all lovely field for not for light seeded seeded and then rolled and then, yeah, i think you know since we're doing this at quite a speed of 13 40 miles an hour i'll go and help the worker now afterwards and then yeah go from there get the rolling done get for rice and yeah by the end of the day we should be all set and then yeah winter is going to be interesting because as mentioned winter is pretty harsh here on on Ravenport and yeah very fun indeed to deal with so yeah let me get this done and I'll see you folks afterwards once we're done here.
hot a minute later, we are done, so field 8 has been drilled with wheat, and grass has been drilled with grass, and we have rolled this. I am thinking, going forward, with again, a lot of stuff, we can just lease it as and when we require, so what I'm going to do is sell our roller here, so repair, repaint, Okay, can't repaint unfortunately, we get a couple hundred quid bucks back from it, so I'm gonna sell that. So yeah, we're at 35 sorry, 30 grand now. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set you off. Because yes, we've got our pickup over here with the trader, so alright, fine. Heat wind does this. So yeah, what I'm gonna do is before we go into December, because we knew from last year and into this early this year, winter is harsh, extremely harsh with deep snow. So what I'm doing is I'm gonna get these trees chopped down and mulched basically into wood chips. So what I'm gonna do is I'll see a partners here. I'll get a tractor, devour this. That we're going to the trader, and yep, yeah, I'm just gonna go around, cut all of these down because, yes, if we look at the so, yeah, also we did sell some of the excess seed and yeah, even some of the sugar and that. So, yeah, like right now we're in November, price is gonna go rocketing up next month, and even into January, and that is actually slightly better. So, so yes, I don't know how capable we're going to be with pretty much doing anything in terms with oh, when it comes to uh, propane cells and that and actually speaking of which we do have a full tank and I'm going to try something a little bit cheeky again depends on how much the leasing cost is for a dolly next to nothing so I'm going to try this see if I can pull this and of course, I had to leave it parked like that. I couldn't just turn it around, so I was just about able to get the full 32,000 liters. And yeah, I was eating from, yeah, selling off the seeds because, yeah, I'm going to be driven for a few months in that, so, and we're going to make more money in that time. Alright, we can just about get this, so I'm going to take a oh, snow stop in here. Alright, let's try something else. Okay, alright, we're having better luck with the case here, so... I'll necessarily pull this over, so worker, yeah, is almost there, so... Let me take this over to the propane plant. This, oh no, because I was going to forget hit that limit, so... This is going to go to the cell, everything container and that, so... Every second was, I'll just take this over here. We're not, again, we're not going to set it now, because that would be intensely cheating. What I'm doing is I'm placing them there ready. Because yeah, when that deep so hits, I do not want to be caught out. I don't know how our lorry that or the lorry we're borrowing, I think, yeah, we're borrowing is gonna cope. I am gonna risk it of keeping it for another month. Or at least another half a month and occur the monthly fees and that for these little daily fees. Whatever you want to call it that. Technically it'll be by month by week. By fortnight, by weekly fees, now. Yeah, by weekly, so two weeks. Anyways, let me take this over there, and I'll see folks up north. Why is that worker stopped? Oh, I don't know. So, right, we're over here. We've got you over here ready. Away from train, so we're not going to get shunted by the train, so... So, yeah, without any further ado... Again, I don't know how much we can get from this. 500 liters. That's not looking too good because yeah, even at peak price. Alright, okay, that's better now. I was going to say, if all these trees were like 500 liters each, I'll be very worried. And yep, yeah, I was. I am going to spend the time getting. Every single tree, every little bit of tree, Matt. Technically, this is our land, so 
Yeah, I knew I'd be able to do it rapidly before a shrine act, but I did get absolute buckets for that. I think you got absolute buckets for that. <laughs> oh, you little cheese on the gun. But yeah, I think overall this is going to be worth it. There we go. And yeah, the whole before shrine I'm all about. I will be replanting these trees now, so don't worry, green piece and I'm piece on that. Okay, your nature's into this. It's all gonna be good. Farming boys is gonna take care of Mother Nature and that. So yeah, I'll spend oh, what next half an hour or so getting this all sorted. And then we'll see where we stand at first. I'm just gonna finish the tree first of all. Alright, so there is hope to make some profits, but as yet it is all to be seen. So right, we are done, so from that area we got 92,000 years of wood chip, so let me set it at its peak price, so yeah, 1200 per thousand years, yeah, we're going to definitely quadruple the cost of the land, so and that's the thing, like, got tracks on this, we've got chunky tires, so yeah, I know deep so is really bad in that, but I'm just hoping with the tracks and that, we can have at least some form of chance in terms of surviving the winter and that. But yeah, all that will be coming in the ooh, next episode. Ooh, should have done that. But yeah, I think, yeah, I should wrap up this episode with... Actually, you know what, let's just go and start everything. So we'll skip ahead till December or even January and that. So, but yeah, so let's go and first of all examine what we've got in total. So right, just in our train pass, so yeah, 92,000 years of wood chips. And that's going to be... Actually, if anything, it's going to be the Great Elevator West. Or is that two? Dang it, we were just up there! Ah, uh, fuck. Oh no, yeah. That and the ranch. Oh, so yeah, this is gonna be fun then because we've got a full three thousand year trip load of these that seventy five thousand years and yeah, we've still got twenty thousand years left. So all right, fair enough. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this load and yeah, this is extremely heavy to pour in that. I barely have any momentum, so this is going to go to the Great Mill West. I'm going to take that lorry up to the ranch, and then, yeah, we're going to sleep and see where we stand in December. So, yeah, right, two and a half right now. I think we just hit an hour on the lorry, that's why we might go down a bit more, but. So, yeah, we're going to be hit quite hard with pet fees and that. But overall, it's going to be worth it in the end. So right, may have skipped ahead a little bit too much, but anyways, we'll sell December's propane. So that's going to get us a nice juicy profit, and yeah, overall, money went up, of course, because we're getting money from our greenhouses, thankfully, and the juice factory, so yeah, it's a good thing we've got those, so it keeps us tickety-boo over the winter. So yeah, this is going to sell, and see how much we get. So, just the propane alone, we've got 56 grand, and I'm going to take a gamble on taking this over to the fuel station and fill up again, and do January's propane cell. So, alright, we're 29 grand, so I thought, yeah, sell it here and that, but there's a bit more money in that, but, yeah, once again, we're hitting that capacity issue, and, yes, overall, I should imagine right with snow now deep snow that. I am very thankful for bits like this where we can actually get a bit of tarmac. Even if it's icy and that. Hmm. If anything I'll say it's better to drive in the snow in that. Because at least they've got something to compact on and actually have traction, but anywho, sell this final load. So there we go, 28 and a half grand. Now, for the wood chips, we should get quite a bit of money from this, so, yes, two grand almost, so, 
So unfold you. And the sorts and everything. Soon you. So yeah, but that money's going to absolutely shoot up now. 64 grand, I'm not sure, sorry. 95, 96 grand, just for that one load there. And yep, should get our final sum. Once we sell these two, so. Ooh, 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 ooh. 400 grand. Can we get 450? Yes, we can. And I think we're going to hit about 471. And yeah, so 471 grand. That leaves us with, so. I think for now, what we can do is return you. Return you. And yeah, do we return this? Because I should I should have kept maybe kept the other stuff because I am tempted over the winter period by a plot of forestry, something like field nine or plot nine. Because yes, we go uh, somewhere over here. So yes, head over here because these are more thicker trees. So yeah, like these trees here get about 15, 20,000 years, I think. So in theory, from those trees there, 100,000 years, 200 grand. Maybe another 10,000 years from these two, 20 to 30. And I think overall, yeah, including bits across that river, I think in general, we'll set up for about yeah, easily, yeah, about 200 to 250,000 liters. For a little bit of forestry, and that costs how much? 36 grand, basically. 36 grand for wood chips, and that's by the map maker. We're still on normal economy, so. Yeah, I'm thinking, let's do that. Yeah, technically, if I would, I'll just go all out. No, get a huge forestry in that and just do that. But yeah, I think if we could do that, get a solid half a mil, that would be enough to pay off this entire loan. And yeah, I think that will set us up for a very good year in that. When it'll be our final year, I extremely doubt it because we still got a million to spend, like, seriously, like. 810 grand for that. So yeah, we're a ways away yet, but yeah, technically this is part of the challenge of purchasing every plot of land. And yeah, I think really wood chips is going to be the key to success, I think. But anyways, I'll leave that pondering idea for next episode. But yeah, anyway, so come to the end of the episode. It's going to be yeah, one well, hour for up the next episode. Because, yes, currently it is 3 o'clock in the morning, so I need to get this edited and that before heading to bed, uploaded onto YouTube. So then, before I go out today on Saturday, this gets uploaded. And then, yeah, so new Let's Play series, South Star on Sunday now. Depending on how long I'm out tomorrow now or today. So yeah, new let's play will be out Sunday, worst case scenario Monday, but I really don't want to do that. So yeah, whenever that is out, hopefully along with Vintage Survival. So yeah, worst case scenario, we're looking around Monday, if not Tuesday before the next episode comes out, so... Yeah, feel free, I do want some feedback. Do we do wood chips now? Do we say yes? Do a bunch of wood chips now, and... Get a lot of these fields purchased, expand the farm that, because yeah, alts to animals as well. For uh, example, we'll get 9 10 in, so we can have that section over there, and that'll be for our grass and hay and that. Oops. Hit a little post there. But yeah, more so is going to be. I show also our silage as well, so our silage and hay for the cows. And that's why we're doing big fields. I think we filled on 11 and 
spring, we're going to do barley. Ooh. Actually, barley and that's planting. Dang it, we've missed barley. Oh. We should have done winter wheat more than that because, yeah, barley, we've missed window. Unless we do, see, oats, get that harvested, that will give us straw nat. So, yeah, unless we do wheat again, but we're going to have a month to get the fields turned around. So, yeah. Oh, that was a little bit of a cock up down my part, but anyway, so, yeah. Give me some ideas down below where I should go from here. But, anyways, that's what I leave it today. And as always, hope you enjoyed the episode. If so, smash that button. Feel free to down below. If you want to share us, please be my guest. If you're not subscribed to our channel, please consider. But, for just do, hope you're going to stay. But for now, it's from Ever Extreme. And I'll see you all very soon. And don't worry, this is February's propane.